Tevera, numerical relay test kit and lab volt uh, electromechanical training kit. All these equipments available. Proudly say that uh, in our college containing this uh, uh, type of equipment, uh, when compared to the our college is uh, uh, not less than the IIT or uh, NIT. Our college uh, has established 400 kilowatt solar power plant with principal amount of uh, 1.25 crores for green energy as well as reducing monthly electricity power bill with the proposal of electrical department and acquired principal amount within three and a half years. Our department and new well settled. Most of the students are placed in four uh, companies and some of them are in IIT, NIT faculty in India and abroad. Once again, thanks to principal and management for this uh, valuable advice and uh, financial support. Thank you for giving me the opportunity. Thanks to one and all. I requested Dr. N. Ramadevi Garu to share her views on this STTP. Society President Sri Manam Nagisaragaru, Secretary Manam Nagisaragaru, Vice President Sri Ramohan Ragaru, Joint Secretary Sri K. Haripadma Prasad Garu, and the Gaudi Battery Member of Subha Rao Garu, Treasurer, Treasurer Sri T. Ramakrishna Rao Garu, our below Trishpreem, Sri Mupalanen Srinivas Rao Garu, Respected HOD Dr. G. Rajkumar Garu, Head of the Department, Participants, My Colleagues and My Dear Students, A very good morning to one and all. It gives me a pleasure to welcome all of you for a one-week short-term training program on soft computing techniques in electrical systems. So first of all, I thanks to our management for giving their continuous support and encouragement to conduct this event. I also say thanks to our beloved principal Sri Dr. Damodar Nayarugaru for providing the facility to conduct this event. It's my privilege to address the, this gathering. The main objective of this one week short term training program is to provide an opportunity for the faculty members and students of various organizations for interaction and exchange of ideas on recent trends in the field of soft computing and its application to electrical systems. Soft computing is a fusion of methodologies designed to model and enable solution to real world problems. So which are not model or too difficult to model mathematically. The aim of soft computing is to explicit and tolerance for imprecision, uncertainty, approximate reasoning and partial truth in order to achieve the close rimbles with human like decision making. For example, so we take some of our electrical applications like economic load dispatch, direct top control for induction motor. For these cases, so whenever uh, we have to take as an objective function of load dispatch, the objective function will have a multiple objective functions and we have to minimize the, the cost function with the help of constraints. So in that case, uh, we require the certain optimization techniques. The classical optimization techniques will give us the multiple local minima. So, but we require only one optimal minimum value. For that purpose, we require the soft computing techniques. So, similar way in direct torque control technique also, we require the parameter estimation. So, the parameter estimation will require the some soft computing techniques which are more uh, performance when compared with the classical approaches. So the parameters which we require for controlling the motors is the proportional integral controllers. So those parameter values is estimated make use of evaluation algorithm techniques or quasi logic techniques. So the cost of computing is nothing but as a 
the four consistence one is the fuzzy logic the second one is the neural network third one is the evaluation algorithms and fourth one is the probabilistic algorithms so make use of these four algorithms so we don't have any mathematical model for the system so such cases we implement these soft computing techniques and achieve the the results which will be similar with the human brain so the objective of this event is we spread along the nation for soft computing technique in the area of electrical systems so we all aware with the, the good performance of this system so for those applications we require the soft computing techniques so with the intention of this we spread the this computing techniques along the so we connect this event event everyone gain the certain knowledge for them with the help of expertization of different faculties so i think everyone must gain certain knowledge in this area and similarly everyone will pay as the attention and acquire the, the minimum knowledge which will required for the further studies thank you thank you given for this opportunity thank you so much for such an honor i request everyone to stand for this invocation janaganamana dinayaka jayahe vidata panjam sindhu